Hi, you guys, and welcome to day two of the Fort Lauderdale show. I have with me Rod from England. He lives here in he lives here in Fort Lauderdale in Coral Springs. He is a member of the Fort Lauderdale Orchid Society and the Boca Orchid Society, so that's exciting. He's gonna walk around with me for today's video. Um, and it's so cool, you know. He came up to me and he watches my channel and he said, Are you have you filmed today? And I said, No. I go, let's film. So here we are. Okay. Say hi. hi. <laughs> now you can't be shy. <laughs> All, right. All right, so let's see. So we are here. This is Day and this is Rod. And here's my booth, you guys. So today has been a very busy, busy, busy day. Um, it's been a packed show. We have done very well today. Have you Rod volunteers, but have you bought anything special? Did you see anything? Did you find anything today that was good? A few things, yes. Mm -hmm. uh, I bought some sphagnum moss. And, uh, oh, so you got supplies. Yeah. Do you know this gentleman right there? Yeah. You know who that is? Some kind of yeah. <laughs> so this is Sheldon. Every time I, every time I make a video, and no joke, he's always, he's always eating. <laughs> Look at him. What is he eating now? <laughs> <laughs> so now he's eating popcorn. Oh. So this is Sheldon. I love Sheldon. He's from Carmela, yeah. um, and and he's the best. And he loves I his popcorn. He's the best. He's the best. He is the best. Yeah. <laughs> so Sheldon today is eating popcorn. You guys. Uh, we had coffee, Pepsi, and popcorn. Two days, <laughs> three days in a row. That's so funny. Um, so you were able to buy some supplies. Did you buy any orchids? Uh, not as yet. Um, okay. And I love your accent. <laughs> so here we have So. You know, So was in my video yesterday. <laughs> Everybody loved you yesterday, so I want to show you again. Thank you so much. Yeah. Busy today. Have you sold a lot today? Busy, busy, huh? Yeah, we sell quite a bit. Uh, yeah, we have it here. And then, uh, yeah, nice. I love my nice. We all love your flowers. You know that I have subscribers that love, love the zygo. So I want to just show that again today. So you guys, this is a zygo that you guys have been um, uh, questioning me about, sending me uh, messages, and I want to just—it's beautiful and it smells like roses. Oh, you want to smell it? it? Smells like roses. Smell that. You smell it? It's like, oh, it smells better than roses. It's a beautiful, look at that, look at just that design. So Esso has these, and this is the name. Is that, no, this is, this is not the tombstone name, no? It's this one right here. That's one is tombstone, but it's, that one is not a tombstone. Oh, so this is, this is a tag for that Zygo. Let me get it, look nice. Yeah. So it's a Zygo Lum, Lewis and Dorf, Rain, Moonlight. And there's um, Esso Orchids, so if you want to get this particular Zygo, you can go head over to Esso Orchids website. And here she is, EssoOrchids.com. So that's that. So you guys were asking about this beautiful Zygo, and here it is again. Beautiful. This one looks a lot like my, my rain clown right here. That's do you any of those? I do. As a matter of fact, I have one of these in bud right now. The zygos on in under my care do very well, <laughs> so I'll be I'll be getting other zygos. All right, so let's walk. Thank you. We're walking the show of day two, and I hadn't shown you guys one particular um, display that I do want to show you really quick, and maybe I'll find the dendrobium I'm looking for. But I did not show you guys this display yesterday. This display is spectacular. So look at this. Rink and Silas Gigantia right here. I love these colors. And look at this Calea right here. This is gorgeous. And then all of, I guess they keep all of the pinky ones on this corner, right? Yeah. Were you guys, since you guys um, are part of the Orchid Society, do you guys help, do you guys come up with like different ideas on how you're gonna do your displays? Because these displays are phenomenal. They're beautiful. Do they? I mean, you guys really take your time brainstorming and just coming up with, with all of these ideas. So the idea of this show, this year is 2020 vision. 
And I love that I, I see. They changed their location from the room. They did. So, yeah, so everything is like glasses, everything is like 2020 vision. And I actually want to say something really quick. All right, so if you guys saw, um, have been watching my, my coverage and my footage of all the different days, um, day one was the day that I had, and I'm sorry, I don't mean to, I just want to say something really quick. So day one was uh, the first day of the show, or not the first day, but the preview party. And that's when I mentioned that these men were wearing these really big glasses. And then yesterday, I went to the magnifying glass and I was talking about that. I didn't know why they had it. And then it dawned on me. They came in costume. <laughs> they came with the big glasses, just um, wanting to be part of the 2020 and kind of like, you know, trying to be funny. And I thought that was so cute. So I just wanted to add that to this video. I got the joke a little bit late, but I thought that was very cute and I wanted to add it. Anyway, this is another display. And if you see that, it has also the glasses and the rink and stylus. I have to tell you that this show has really outdone themselves with all of these Rincon stylists. There's just so many beautiful, beautiful Rincon stylists here. And these are displays that I haven't been able to feature in any of my other videos. But they are fabulous. So this one's from Wilson Orchids. And they got a hundred. First place in a 100 square, square foot open class. That's cool. It's nice. They got first place. This was Wilson Orchids, and they're the ones that came here um, with the bag, with the bagged, um, with the bagged orchids, the bag babies, right? Yeah, I think they're over there on that side. So everything is just so. Oh my goodness, the displays here are spectacular. It's like you can tell the work, you can tell the thought they've put into this. You can tell like just the themes are just amazing. I love it. This is Ritter's. You guys have seen that in my other videos, but it's just beautiful. Let's see. And and these are very cool. Do you have any of these? Yeah. No. No? Insect eating man plants. Yeah. I'm, I will be, I don't know. Mosquitoes. <laughs> I did buy one one time and it didn't work. No, I know. It's, I just, I don't know. I mean, I don't want to say anything like. I think you drop a, a little bit of water in the bottom of this. And okay. It attracts the mosquitoes or whatever. And it attracts and the mosquitoes in there? And traps them. And then what? They just. Disintegrate or they disintegrate and uh, feeds the plant. Oh, it feeds a plant. I don't know. I'm just not an insect loving person, so I don't think I would want. I don't know. I just, I don't know. I mean, they're beautiful, but anyway, moving right along, I think that that's very interesting. Oh, I know. <laughs> and do you know this lady right here? She's hiding from me. <laughs> <laughs> She's a, She's a, Do you know Linda yeah. from Ritters? Yeah. Hi. 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 So Linda's awesome. Yes. Let's see. Let's feature Linda. Oh, Linda. Linda, it's yeah. been a good show. Has it? Well, you've been busy. I've been busy. Yeah, I've been busy, busy, yeah. busy, busy today. So you sold out all your candles. So I didn't sell out of all my candles, but, but um, they still it's, have it's, one day. I still have one day. So what has been like your best seller? Like you feel like. Mm -hmm. You know what? I'm going to interview you, Linda. Oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> well, I just want to see, like, what has, what do you feel everybody has wanted, like, this show? Is there, like, a specific, maybe a specific oh, they like species. species? Like oh, what? Yeah. Like, tell me. Show me. Species. This time is Rincostilis gigantea, different well. colors. Red. Okay. And, uh, spotted and the orange. Well, you know what? Probably what's attracting everybody to the displays. The yeah, displays one. are amazing. amazing. And you know what? And you see it's so beautiful there and you want to get that. So I was telling him, I was like, they've outdone the show this year with all of these gigantias, all these Rincon stylists, because they are just so beautiful. And look at this. I have a few in my collection. Actually, I just had a one that sprouted for bud, but then it, it blasted. So what can I do? What have, just wait for weather. next year. Oh no! Really? It will, re it will uh, re flower again. But it's gonna be a whole year before I got another spike. But it will be more flowers 
Yeah. Look at how beautiful. So everybody is looking for all for these, and you know what? I have seen a, a, few, a few. I've seen a lot of people walking around with these. But it's. I'm telling you, it's a, this beautiful displays that that people put. Yeah. Yeah, that's awesome. So, oh, go ahead. <laughs> so this was, you know, Linda. So she just gave me some really good information. Everybody's wanting to get their hands on this. Oh, they're wanting to get these. Oh, so, so people are wanting to get this species too. And what is this? What kind of orchid is this? Oh, it smells like cinnamon. Oh my goodness, it does smell like cinnamon. Every morning it's still strong. Oh my goodness. And, and? No, this is her booth. <laughs> go ahead, go, go, go. Sorry. Ooh. Wow. This is good. All right, you guys. Well. Oh my goodness. All right. So I had some I have some good information for you guys. So Linda was telling me that everybody um or not everybody, but that this is very popular also. Um this weekend and this is a tag. I'm not sure what um the name the name is here, but it's an aromatica. La casta. La casta. This is La Casta right here, the LYC. Okay. But what kind of orchid is this? Is it like a yeah, so. Linda? What kind? <laughs> what kind of what kind of, but what kind of orchid? Sorry, what kind of orchid is this? It's a lecaste, lecaste aromatica. Lecasta aromatica. Yeah. Is it in the family of what? Like nothing? It's just like um, Stanhopia, Stanhopia. In that, in that group. So. Oh, it's in the catacetum group. That is, no, no. It's a no. More, uh, different from catacetum. No. Like uh, wow. Gombura. And look at the size of these leaves. Yeah, the leaves. It will lose it. The leaves, the leaves will get lost, lost but and, then and it's just gonna be flowers and flowers. Wow, you guys, and this smells like cinnamon. This is yeah, amazing, yeah. amazing. Wow, and it flowers how often? Uh, just once a year. Once a year, and it normally flowers like yeah. yeah, like two or three. But it smells like pure cinnamon. So that's if you have a big one, like specimen, it'll be lots of flowers. lots of flowers. That is beautiful. So a lot of people are wanting this. Yeah, just uh, just one bulb, uh, two bulbs. And the flowers there. Nice. That's awesome. All right. Well, good. I hope. Thank you. Well, that that's awesome. Thank you, Linda. Oh, yay. <laughs> so we're walking. Here we have Bernard. Oh. And he's almost sold out of all of his bandas. And this is spectacular. Woohoo! <laughs> Come and spend your money here at BNL. Yes. Or BL. 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 BL Orchids. BL Orchids. Find me on eBay, BL Orchids. Yeah. <laughs> he's so cute. So look at all of these bandas. Look at this. This is what I love. <gasps> Isn't that just spectacular? And you know, he got an award for best display. Grand champion. Grand champion. Look at that. And look at that! Look at his display, and I've I've shown you, I've shown my my channel this display probably three times already, and every every day of the show. But grand look at the champion. size. Yeah, he's a grand champion. Look at the size of this. Look at this. Look at this. Wow. So that is awesome. Congratulations to Bernard. Is this what? Is that Bernard's as well? Yes. Beautiful, right? Beautiful. Grand champion. Yeah. Yeah, he's done amazing. So these are his his bandas right there. And so this is day two. Are you gonna be back tomorrow? Uh, I might be. Yeah. I love his accent. I might be. This is lady here. Do we? Oh, she's a member. Okay. And she's shopping. I see. Zoe. Hi, Zoe. Oh, here's Zoe buying. She's a member of the Fort Lauderdale Orchid Society. Okay. This one here. And what is the name? I'm terrible with names. Crustacea radiata. Oh, 
and it smells sweet. And you no. have to photograph this one. Okay, I love Big that Vienna one. Vienna smells uh, lemony, Vienna. Mm -hmm. lemony in the morning. I love it. it oh, it smells lemony right now. Wow. Then we have uh, some that smell like coconut, which mm -hmm. is the kind of folia. Yeah, yeah, that's awesome. I have those in my garden. This I love them. This vendor uh, has a variety, lots of different types. Um, yeah. And then my other one that I'm buying today mm -hmm. is, is was one of our winners on it's our on our table. Oh. Did you see our winner in the table? What kind of it's, 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 it's this one. It's this the cordigera. Oh. Look at how beautiful. And this one's lovely. Unfortunately, I kill these. Oh my goodness. Mm -hmm. So my cordigeras did not like me. So let's see what you got. A red one. The dendrobium. Something. Uh, I'm, I'm terrible with names. <laughs> nice. And this is red. That's awesome. Yeah. Nice. Well, congratulations. And this is Dora, you guys. She has an Instagram. And she shares all of her orchids on Instagram. What's your Instagram name? Dora A. Rangel. Yeah, Dora A. Rangel. So if you want to see pretty flowers, follow her on Instagram because she's she's taking home a lot of orchids today. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> and nice to see you. Nice to see you too. And now bye. Ay, I know. <laughs> enjoy, enjoy. Thank you. <laughs> All right, so it's so nice to walk around with members of the Orchid Societies. I love Smiley. I love her. She's awesome. And she's always smiling. Well, that's, what, that's why that's her name, Smiley. Yeah. Yeah, Smiley's my friend. <laughs> so he's walking with me today. Yeah, he's walking with me. <laughs> so, Smiley, I want to ask you: What has has there people been like a specific orchid? Have you do you, have you noticed like everybody wants like the same orchid, or are they buying different orchids? Or I'm trying to see what people are liking. They Tell me. Buy everything. They buy everything. Well, that's good. <laughs> They like species. And, uh, I like, I like them too. Yes. Mm -hmm. So what species are they wanting? This one? The one that you're in the picture with? Yeah, this one very good. Uh, people, that's my, we call highlight. I know. That's the name I can't say. That one is, we call Sologeny Rochester. Sologeny. This is the one that I showed you guys yesterday when Smiley was showing me the picture. Yeah. The one so everybody's wanting to come over here and buy this? Is that what people are wanting to buy? They come, yes. Yeah? Right. Well, that's good. And they like and then, black pearl. About black pearl. Yeah. So then how come you call it black pearl and then other people call it witchcraft? Or is so it a different? It's different. Different. They are different, yes. Okay. Yeah. What is the difference? Oh, the black pearl has a little bit of red. Oh, 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 you see, I, I noticed that. So the witchcraft is a Yes. Okay, you guys. So the witchcraft is pitch black. And I have this one in my collection. As a matter of fact. Yes. you smell this at nighttime and they smell like cough syrup. Like cough syrup? Yeah. So to me, when, my, when mine blooms, it smells like peppermint. Peppermint? Yeah. It smells like peppermint. It smells like minty, minty, minty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So here you have two of the cenoches and the caddis. So this is a cenoche or a caddisetum? The monara is a caddisetum with the, okay. what you call, I get the thing writing down. So the, <laughs> so then you've got this one, which is all black, and then you've got the black pearl, which has a little bit of the red right over here. You see that? No, that one doesn't have the red. So this one um, smells like gingerbread, and the other one smells more like peppermint, or like a mint. <laughs> Look at that. Oh my gosh. Look at this one. 
Wow, that one's amazing. And this is a black pearl? The minute black pearl. pearl. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So Smiley is unwrapping a black pearl so I can get a better look at that. Is that a um, Fred Clark uh, cross That's Smiley? Fred Clark. Beautiful. Look at that. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh my goodness, Smiley. Beautiful. Hey, Bloom. The seed is how big. Look at that. Wow. Well, thank you guys. Thank you for showing this. I'm sure everybody's going to appreciate this. Look at that. And look at the lip. And smell like, like ging gingerbread. Like gingerbread. <laughs> you don't like gingerbread? Yeah. It's all good. Yeah. <laughs> the smell is making me feel good. Yeah. Oh my gosh. And it sample, smells amazing. Is that a sales sample? Or are you selling this one? Yeah, we sell that. Yeah. How much are you selling? How much? 200. For 200. So you guys, if you want to get something spectacular this weekend, you can come over to the Fort Lauderdale show and Smiley has this beautiful black pearl double spike. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Look at that. For $200. So that cheaper, is awesome. Yeah, you can get the one, the other ones are a little bit less. But the ones, the double spikers up here, those are amazing. Those are amazing. Look at that. This one is very cool. Yeah, that one's awesome. So, so you know. So, now you know. Head on over to Fort Lauderdale and come and hit up a smiley. My favorite, favorite smiley. She's so cute. She's got these black pearls, amazing, with double spikes. Amazing gingerbread smell, and you can come over and pick them up for $200. So, I am just gonna work my way back to my booth because I have to get to work. And let's see what's going on over there. There he is. You see, my poor husband is probably waiting for me to get there and tend back to my booth. So, this is day two of the show. Very busy today. I was able to get a break because I have some help behind the booth and then I even have a helper today. I have a companion today and it's so nice to meet right. you. Nice Aww. to meet you as well. So, you take care of yourself. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And you keep watching. Thank you. I will, I'll keep watching you. It's very yeah. interesting. Thank you, thank you okay. so, so much. And um, enjoy the show. Yeah. And I will see you at Boca. So he's also part of the Boca Orchid Society. I will be in Boca February 7th and 8th. So if you guys are in the Boca area or around from there, um, I will be there with my candles and Rod will be there volunteering at the show. Okay. Right, yeah. You Did you have fun? Yeah. Good. <laughs> All right, you guys, you're welcome. So I also wanted to tell you really quick before I finish up my video, I met so many of you guys today. It was very busy. It was amazing. Um, I mean, I have to tell you that I almost, bye Rod. I was, <laughs> I was almost in tears, um, happy tears, because I had this subscriber come to my booth. He's actually from Trinidad. He came to Miami to go on a cruise ship, because if you don't know, uh, we are actually in the same port as, um, as where the cruise ships, um, hold on, let me just turn around really quick. My husband's there. I am, thank you, enjoy them. Turned around, we're like, yeah, we're getting. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you, like, thank you so minutes. much. <laughs> Enjoy it. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh my God, you see, I love this. I love this, and I, and I am. Oh my God, and here's Joan, and she is like in love with my husband. Look at her. Oh my. <laughs> That's your eye candy. <laughs> we're just having too much fun today. We are just having a blast. So. I do. I recycle them. Yes, 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 yes. So back to my story. So it's this um, gentleman, Jason, from Trinidad. And he is, um, he was getting on a ship and he was going to take a cruise. Well, he did take a cruise. Right now he's on his trip. Jason, I hope you have the best, the best vacation. Um, and before, uh, you know, he had no idea this was going on, so it was like a perk that he was able to attend an orchid show because he collects orchids and he does this whole orchid uh, growing thing in Trinidad. So he was able to come to the show and uh, be part of the Fort Lauderdale Orchid Society show. And 
So he came by my booth, he said hi, he introduced himself, you know, I was so happy to meet him. And on his way out, when he was leaving, he came back to my booth, and I know this story is really long, but I'm getting to the end. He came back to my booth, and he brought me these right here. So I'm going to turn around and show you what Jason has gifted me with. And you guys, I have to tell you that I was so surprised, and I'm so, so thankful. This is like the nicest thing ever. Uh, so Jason bought me from Cruel Smith Orchids a BLC Jungle... Mark Jones you know I'm terrible with names but I am dying to see what these blooms look like I haven't even been able to google it but I'm sure it's exactly what I've wanted which is that cat Leia with those different color purples and pinks so these are the buds for that one and then he also got me this beauty I mean just looking at the buds I'm in love I'm in love and here is the other one so this is an RLC Heaven's Gate Christelle and that's also from Scroll Smith so that was like so nice I'm telling you I was almost in tears um, when he showed up with that he gave that to me as a gift he was like you know an early birthday present and I just thought that was so sweet so Jason I hope you're having a wonderful vacation I hope you when you get back you you see this video and you know how grateful I am and thankful and I so love them so I can't wait for those to bloom I'll show you guys a video on that and um, that's it so this is day two of the show uh, it has been crazy it has been busy um, so it's all good we are working and enjoying the view I um, just wanted to show you really quick before I go I promise that it, this is gonna be the end I made this candle for myself last night this is part of all the personalization deal that I do so I'm very happy. This is actually a jumbo size candle that I make here for the shows. So I wanted to show you that. And that's it. Uh, thank you for watching. I will be back here tomorrow for day three, last day of the show. Um, and I hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you soon. Mwah. Bye. Say bye, babe. Peace. Peace. <laughs> bye. <laughs>